restaurant-style matar pamir that is green peas and cottage cheese curry. First of all boil 1 cup of fresh green peas and 2 cups of water over medium heat for 10 minutes. You may use frozen green peas also, but thaw them to room temperature before using. In the meanwhile when peas are boiling, deep fry 100 or 150 gram cottage cheese which is cut into 1 inch size cubes. Fry while turning sides occasionally for 5 to 7 minutes, or until cheese cubes are golden at edges. Drain fried cheese cubes directly into a bowl of water. Putting fried cheese cubes into water immediately after frying turns them very soft and it tastes very good to eat fried soft cheese cubes in curry. Keep aside for a while. Check doneness after boiling green peas for 10 minutes. They should be very tender and mushy soft. If required boil further for few minutes. Remove from heat and set it aside too. Now put a pan over medium heat with 1 tablespoon cooking oil or ghee in it. Add in 1 teaspoon cumin seeds. And when cumin starts crackling add 2 tablespoon earlier prepared onion and tomato masala into pan. Always make it a practice to keep prepared masala in your fridge to be used as and when required. It helps you in cooking complex dishes very fast and saves your time on serving day. Stir and saute masala for a couple of minutes or until heated through. Now add required seasonings into masala. Remember that you might have added some spices while preparing masala. Stir and saute for half a minute then. Add little milk or water into masala to prevent burning of spices. Now add 1 tablespoon fresh milk cream into pan. Stir and cook for 2 to 3 minutes or until grease is released. Add boiled peas along with boiling water into pan. Add more water if you want thinner gravy. Stir to mix then add fried cottage cheese cubes also into the pan. Stir and simmer for 5 minutes. Now, now check and adjust the seasonings at this stage then sprinkle with half teaspoon garam masala and 1 teaspoon crumbled kashmiri methi that is dried fenugreek leaves. Stir to mix. Cover the pan and turn off the heat. Delicious matar pamir is ready. Serve warm over rice or accompanied with naan chapati or parantha. Enjoy. Like and subscribe for more recipe videos. It is absolutely free.